But, Dr. Cortex, we have not determined the cause of past failures. Moral! <laughs> this bandicoot will be my general, and he will lead my Cortex commandos to world domination. This time, I shall reign triumphant. We are closer than ever before. Quickly! Into the vortex! The Dr. Cortex, the vortex is not ready. We have no idea what it could do. <laughs> Failure again. Capture him! Uh-oh. Prepare the female bandit. And thus Crap was born. Hey guys, it's Sensei Mewtwo12345, and I'm here with... Warman76. And this is going to be my... Kind of Thanksgiving special. This is Crash Bandicoot 1. I'm going to play through this game completely uncut, and who knows, depending on how quickly I do it, I may just upload the whole thing as one episode, so uh, it legitimately is only on Thanksgiving. So, <laughs> anyway, let's start the game. No, I don't want to. <sighs> right when I went to start the game, it did this. That stinks. And now we have demos. Unfortunately, yeah, since this is going to be completely no. uncut, we will leave this. <laughs> 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 yeah, you know, something interesting. Why does Cortex want a bandicoot to lead his armies? It's kind of like, what's the point? I know. Do it yourself. Good question. Be like and Eggman is... and actually lead your robots. And this game is so old that the analog does not work. In fact, the entire game derps out if you try to use the analog stick and you can't do anything. So... Same thing happens <laughs> with uh, Final Fantasy. So you hit the yeah. analog button, none of the buttons work anymore. <laughs> oh, old PlayStation games. Then if you turn off the analog, it starts working again. Give me my wampa fruit. Hello, Mr. Crab. Die, Mr. Crab. You know, it's funny. As a kid, I always liked, um, uh, Crash. Uh, well, not... Well, ever since, um, Sensei introduced it to me. But the funny thing is... I... Despite liking it, unlike Spyro, I have never uh, actually owned until. D actually, no, that, that's still that's still Veron's. Um, I have never actually owned a Crash game. So it's just. Then kind of you, funny. sir, don't even haven't even owned a PlayStation One. I'm sorry, you haven't. <laughs> what are you talking about? I have a PlayStation One in my room. I know, but you haven't actually owned it <laughs> if you have not played a single Crash game on it. That is or not... owned a single Crash game, rather. Yeah, I have played the Crash game. I've, I've, oh, which uh, way to go? I, I hate played, forks in the roads. I've played this will not be 100%, by the way. This game is incredibly difficult, 100%. So, yeah. But, uh, you'll get uh, it. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> the controls are so edgy on this game. Yes, it's as I said some time ago, when it comes to playing a game, you do what you can and what you are willing to do. Yeah. Because the game is meant, games are meant to be fun, not torture. <laughs> yes. <laughs> not everything is Kaizo Mario, not everything has to be the video game version of cutting yourself. So... Except for, uh... So we're this way, anyway. So, uh... One thing, though... Despite saying this, there's, there are two games where... Oh, this is actually fairly easy. I can do this. There are actually two games where... Um... Uh, 100 percenting the game is practically the only way you're going to actually win that game. That is the first Legend of Zelda game and the second Legend of Zelda game. If you do not 100% them, you get all the heart pieces and sword and shield and everything upgrades. You will find the game so much the harder because it's just annoying, hard, and tedious. 
I mean, they make if you had get a game over. Ah, uh, dang it! Again, give me the what? What? This is what I hate about this game is even if you do get all the boxes, you have to land on the last four pad in a special way in order for it to actually count. That's stupid. I know. It's the reason why I will not 100% this game. This game. Uh, this game. <laughs> Just be thankful you're not that looking at it. It's not as bad as. Um, Wrath of Cortex. Uh, just be, just be glad that the game. Did I will you, not did do you actually, one. Like, enjoy this game or something. Well, yeah, I do like this game. I just don't like one hundred percenting it. One hundred percenting this game is terrible. Whoa! What the heck is that? That is a token that lets me into the bonus area, so... Huh. Once you collect all three of those tokens, you go to the bonus area, so... Oh. Yeah... Um... Yeah, you can definitely see the improvement in the later Crash games. Yeah... Um... Uh... What?! <laughs> The heck? Just be glad that you actually enjoyed this game versus. Uh, didn't you find like some of the other one? versus some of some games just not. Wrath of Cortex. <laughs> you will never convince me to LP Wrath of Cortex. It's not gonna happen. That is. That game shouldn't even exist. Let's see. Is that the one with the um? Where Crush is introduced? Yeah. Number it's one horrible though. They pretty much tried to rip off uh, Crash Bandicoot Warped and failed miserably. <laughs> hey, at least it's better than Crash Tag Team Racing. That is by far yeah. one of the worst games. Let's pretend I've ever that game seen. never existed. I can't. It's one of the games that Joshua owns because well, J Ron owns because we well, got then slap some sense into the man. <laughs> no, we don't we don't play it. He agrees, it's a terrible game. Then sell it to <laughs> some idiot who will buy it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, um Oh know? yeah, the only way to save is to go to one of these bonus areas, so that's kinda of stupid. Yeah, yeah, um, the thing, the reason we own that game, though, is because we got a special crash, well, in her, my current spot, a special, um, crash bandicoot, um, collector pack thing, I don't know. It had crash nitro part, okay. um, and cr you know, crash nitro part, crash twin sanity, and... Crash tag teams. I still didn't land on it right. How can you land on it wrong? That's all I can say about that. Like, there's a certain way you have to land on it in order to get the menu to pop up. I can never do it. <laughs> yeah. Some games. The Grand have, Gate. Some games just have some really stupid and ridiculous requirements. I remember I had a server on Pokemon Battle.net or something like that. Pokemon you remember Net Battle? Net Battle, yeah. You remember that? Yeah. I had that a server. I had a server on that that had like an like had like a command style, you know, make your choices kind of know, RPG kind of thing. It was based off this game and it was kinda of cool, but <laughs> Wasn't there like a way in that game to um, get a sabli with um, Shed Ninja's ability? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> the only way you're gonna kill that Pokemon is if you just happen to be one of the people who use the move your side. Which is actually kind of stupid because there's not really much point in a so fighting I... type being able to hit most ghost types, since most ghost types just happen Wouldn't to be... Wouldn't Odor Sleuth work as well, though? No, um, well, no, because Odor Sleuth allows, um, 
normal type moves to hit ghosts, but uh, you need special you need moves that. Are oh yeah, effective. right. You need a move that's super effective. Oh god, ah, you stupid Native stupid American. American. Oh, this game is kind of <laughs> prejudiced against Native American. If you think about it. Well, he's not really a Native American now you think about because they all live on islands. So he's more like an Aborigine. Oh god! Which makes more sense because Crash is a marsupial. <laughs> That's true. Still, still, no matter how you look at it, it's still going against their like. Yeah. I just got my butt burned. Whoa! <clears throat> yeah, it's kind of funny how you can look at these old games and then. You can like come back to these old games so many years later and then realize how many stereotyping they do in them. I know. And then you're like, oh my goodness, I cannot believe. Well, then again, I was a Oh my goodness gracious me. <laughs> yeah, sometimes you're like, how did I not notice that? And then, uh, but uh, it's like, uh, but if you think about it, it makes sense that you wouldn't notice it because, it's like, you're a kid. You're not gonna think about these things, especially since you're mostly ignorant when you're a child. You can see there are 26 gems and two keys in this game. I don't know how to get either of the keys. <laughs> Do you get any, like, bonuses from getting all of the gems? Um, you get to go to a place towards the end of the game. Not that much. Oh, I landed on the thing right this time. And that will bring you to this menu. Only I missed all the boxes in the bonus area, so... Or in the other bonus area that you need the colored gem for. So, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I landed on it right, only to find out <laughs> I missed! <laughs> Yay! Oh, I hate this 100%ing this game. I haven't even done it before because it's just so tedious. <laughs> yeah, it's already hard enough as it is. Like, these levels are pretty easy. They get a lot harder. A lot harder. <laughs> I remember ripping my hair out as a kid trying to just beat this game normally. <laughs> Indiana Jones ripoff once more! I wonder if I'll fall through the ground as I have in every <laughs> other Crash game before this one. <laughs> uh, didn't we like Nebulous? Like, between Boba... Yeah, I think this was like some kind of uh, birthday gift or something if oh, I yeah. remember correctly. Ah! <laughs> uh, yeah. uh, uh, it's like so much nostalgia, and then you remember how frustrating it is. <laughs> so, yeah, this is like one of those games where you go online. I'm guessing this is one of those games where in order to really 100% it, your best way of actually getting it is to either be a lucky idiot or go online and discover the things, the trolling things they put on, put in the stupidest places. Yeah, and that's the, um, probably the most amazing thing about my experience with Crash 2 is I beat that game 100% as a kid without online help. <laughs> so, <laughs> trying to figure out everything you did, most, most, for the most part I found everything out on accident, so... <laughs> it's actually the same way... I was horrible at the game, and so I would, like, fall into every pit, <laughs> and that's how I discovered how to get the things like the purple gem, or the... One gem in the level with the boulder, or with the bear, that that one, where you have to intentionally fall into the pit. <laughs> <laughs> it's like one of those things. That's one of those levels where it's like, "Hey, look, I did it right, but I already know I missed at least one box." <laughs> <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I don't care. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah, it's kind of the same way for me for Final Fantasy VI, except I'm not sucking at it or anything. It's just, uh, I just happen to be just, I just happen to discover a bunch of random crap just because I feel like, uh, going all over the place. Like, I feel like going in this direction, oh running into this wall, and oh, Whoa! Oh, what oh. just killed me? Since I have been using it online. What have I got? Anyways, but it's like I think it was like a piranha. Oh, it's like it was a, like this it's thing, the except the flailing fish. The flailing fish. I got killed by basically a magic card. <laughs> I'm so good at this magic game. Magic card <laughs> use flail. Arce Arceus fainted. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so good at this game. <laughs> The only thing I can think of when looking at those fish is the piranhas from Rayman 2. Another game where 100%ing it is just tedious because there are some stupid things where it's like, why the heck would I think to do that? So it's like, who was the genius who thought, hey, let's just fly into that? wall right there just cause I can and go, oh well what do you know? Well you do eventually get a little on detector, don't you? No! You do, no! do and rain They instant kill you even if you have Aku? Ugh, this game. <laughs> well they do kinda eat you. If you're in the digestive tract, I'm pretty sure that Aku can Of a plant! I'm pretty sure Aku is uh, basically a carnivorous lily pad. <laughs> I'm pretty sure Aku is like pew, pew, pew. dead, 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 destroyed instantaneously, pretty fast. Uh, okay. Yay! You need the yellow gem in order to go into the waterfall and do things. You gonna be showing that part of that part at least, or new? No, I don't know how to get the colored gems or what levels you get the colored gems from. I know actually very little about this game because I haven't owned it in so long. Ah. And these bonus areas, boy do they become jerkish. Yeah. And then they start putting in multiple bonus areas in the level, and of course the problem with the bonus areas is if you screw up, you can't go back and try again. You have to start the whole level over again. <laughs> yeah, that lum detector that you were talking about. <coughs> yeah. Um, that is... I can definitely see how different... Just that one... Thing that actually shows how different. Um, I kind of feel like this would be like a good, like PlayStation 2 thing to live stream. But the problem is, I have so many viewer, I have so few viewers, and so few of them know of my Facebook or my t Twitch TV account that there would be no point because nobody would watch the live stream. <laughs> <laughs> So, Bobble I'm like losing my boys because I don't know why. Bobble <laughs> Bobble needs to like drink water. <laughs> needs to drink more water so I can wake up. Whoa! Yay for an incredibly easy boss fight. Can you just like sit on that, stand on that chair the whole time? And, uh, yeah, but you can't hurt him like that, and we get to see a nice view of Papu Papu's butt crack. Because <laughs> we always wanted to see the butt crack of a fat aborigine. <laughs> Rolling Stones. That's not a reference to a band at all. <laughs> these aren't really Rolling Stones, they're Rolling... Well, I guess they are made of stone and they're rolling, but they're wheels. They're rolling wheels.
We uh, may not own Crash Bandicoot, but at least uh, I have... This is the first of the Embryo Token bonus areas. Uh, <laughs> I hate those bonus areas. They give me nightmares. <laughs> Wow, that like was interesting. Old, didn't you say some some time ago that like this was the only game where um, Cortex is not the final fight or something? No, Cortex is the final fight in this game. Yeah. I don't remember ever saying that. The only game I can think of where Cortex isn't the final fight out of all the Crash games is Crash Twin Sanity. Yeah, I may not own... Crash games, but at least I have played them. Yeah. And if you think about it, in a way, I kind of own oh, Crash Twin Sanity and Crash Nitro Kart, considering that we have to kind of share the game, anyways. Even uh, though, even though it was J Ron's Christmas gift, he still has to share it. With no, him. stupid Corona plant! Look what you've done. Oh, I can still get it. Okay. Die, squirrels! Ah, oh, that, that was terrible timing. <laughs> that was a short-lived Aku. Thank you, bonus area. Now I'm probably gonna die in here and lose it. Oh, actually, this one's quite simple. They get much, much harder. Like, you'll see if I unlock the Embryo one. That's in this level. Uh... <laughs> Those bonus areas, I don't even know if they're even possible sometimes. <laughs> so the bonus areas in this game aren't like um, the other games where it's just you go back to where you were and nothing really, it doesn't actually affect you. Well, yeah, it doesn't affect you, but they're so hard. <laughs> like you said that you'd probably die in there and lose Akuoku. Yeah, you'd lose Aku Aku in the bonus area in any other game anyway, so... Oh, really? Yeah. I did not know that. Yeah, I actually dread the bonus areas in this game. Like, the bonus areas in these first few levels aren't that bad. They get much worse. <laughs> <laughs> now we get to see a Brio one. Yay! <laughs> TNT! Uh, 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 uh. Well, I'm doing good so far. Uh. Run! Wow, I actually made it to the end. This is probably the only time you'll ever see that. <laughs> that was actually an easy one. They get much worse. <laughs> And that one was still pretty bad. <laughs> and I think I may have actually gotten a gem this time. Or not! <laughs> I completed the Brio bonus area. I did both of the bonus areas. What more do you want? <laughs> I want six more boxes. <laughs> Hog wild. These are really hard. This is probably where I'm going to start dying. The crash thinks it's a good idea. Because the controls I... for this are horrible. <laughs> and crash seems to think it's a good idea to ride a wild boar, which is a terrible idea, quite honestly, because boars are actually one of the most one of the uh, most dangerous animals. Out there in the wild, <laughs> which is funny. Cause the problem is, is the moving targets that you have to avoid move so fast, get you can get you turn so slowly. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Dang it. Yeah. Um. Oh, sweet merciful checkpoint. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of funny that boars are one of the more dangerous animals in the wild, seeing as how they're not even one of the... They're not even a predator. It's like, you would think a predator would be in the top dinner, but it's, ironically yeah, enough, well, it's not a predator. 
predators aren't the more vicious animals out there, which is kind of interesting to think about. Did I actually get everything? Let's What's happening? Up. Or no, it doesn't even give me the thing. What the heck? I got all the... No! Okay, fine. Maybe you have to enter in in a certain way. Exactly! <laughs> <laughs> Then again, there are 26 gems for 32 levels. Let's see. If I remember correctly, this level is actually pretty difficult. Ugh. Of course, the difficulty increases drastically very quickly in this game, so... Yeah, there are 26 gems for 42... For, not 42. Here's 42. For 26 gems <laughs> for 32 levels. Um, yeah, there's some levels that don't have gems. Maybe that was one of them, but... Uh, I'm guessing maybe the hard ones aren't, so... I guess... At least there are only two hog levels, so... There are only two of them? Yeah. What other kind of levels don't have gems? Is there anything like the hog levels? Not that I can think of immediately. Die! No! No! <laughs> that was close. You no, know, I. It's interesting to realize that our commentary hasn't been so... I know, we haven't really been talking about this game much at all. Well, we actually have been talking about this game a lot. Well, yeah, but we we've just been talking been about a lot funny. of other... Well, nothing funny has happened yet, because this is just easy crap at the beginning. It's much harder, and when it does, I will probably be flipping out. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll be the common person on calm. I got her. Dang you. Which is kind of stupid, but you really should have been out of the bass. The, the blast bass radius. <laughs> the blast range. Loading the bonus round. The Yay for the box you can't see! Yeah! <laughs> of course they... Kinda... They did that in Crash 2 as well, though, so... Well, at least they kind of put it in an indicator with the jump box. Yeah. At least it wasn't like Crash 2 where they really gave you no indication to believe that the box was there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Crash 2... Like, for me, is one of the easiest games, 100%, but to other people who don't know it as much, it has to be one of the hardest. <laughs> I just know way more about that game than I should. <laughs> oh, Aku, I forget him. We don't need him. It's almost kind of like me with... Watch me die a lot after skipping him. <laughs> with, uh... Nora's Mask and Ocarina of Time. I could probably 100% um, at least most... <laughs> at least most of both without referencing anything. Yeah, same here for uh, Ocarina of Time. I know a lot of Trixies for that game. Like, maybe I'll OP that in the future, but the problem is, is it's so overdone. Yeah. Of course, then it's like one of those games that if you're an LP -er, it's like required that you <laughs> LP it eventually, which is why it's overdone. So I may do that game, you know, sometime. I don't think anytime soon, though. I'll be getting to it. I already I'll know. I'll like my third. Like, after I'm done with- ah! Oh! Now we get to see his the first death sequence. Well, I've already died already a few times, just yeah. not to the spikes. 
Yeah, oh God, that, that wasn't no. a, that wasn't even, that wasn't an actual like death sequence. I was just in the beginning of the game. Not really much there. That was no. <laughs> Our second death sequence. Yeah. Is there gonna be any of those like angel deaths? No, but you saw it earlier with the black screen, and that pretty much replaces the angel death. <laughs> Don't you mean the angel death pretty much replaces that? No! Nah! Well, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> I am smart, Alec. <laughs> I'm having a hard enough time concentrating on this difficult level as it is. I don't need you. <laughs> Backseat driving. <laughs> what? No, what? That didn't even make what? sense. <laughs> I know. Glitchy PS1! <laughs> this game has glitchy! Glitchy glitcher! I did it again! Okay, let's approach this slowly. I'm speeding too fast through this game, Sensei. That's not a good idea. <laughs> You know, it's kind of interesting how... No! No! <laughs> you know, you will not eat me a third time. The... Wasn't that only the second? No, it was the third. <laughs> you know, the funny thing about... No! <laughs> the funny thing about that... That was that when you got eaten the, the time before you destroyed it. Um... Uh, what is the next checkpoint? <laughs> when you got eaten the time before when you destroyed it, um, you it actually looked more like you should have died there than when you Okay now if I can avoid now if See I can like avoid. right there. That looked more like you should have been eaten than surviving. That's weird. Alright, let that go up. See now if I can avoid the. <laughs> I don't understand why our commentary is so lacking. <laughs> 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 All right, back up this we go. No, piece of crap. <laughs> Did I just blow away that life? No. <laughs> okay. Now if we can just land on this correctly. Uh, nah. This game. There shouldn't even be a correct way to land on it. I know. This game is. Stupid. <laughs> it's fun to not 100%, but trying to 100% it is uber stupid. <laughs> Why would you even want to? Oh my God. There's not even that much of a reward for doing so, so. Unlike in the second one, wasn't it? Where, like, if you yeah, you get a secret ending. Yeah. Like, you get that... Don't you get, like, a special weapon thing if you get all, like, ones? Well, you get a cutscene where Embryo fires a laser and destroys Cortex's space station, so... I thought you got, got like, a special weapon. No, what?! I... I don't even... I have to go back and watch that recording to even know what happened. I think I like spun on the monkey and then things happened and people died and the monkey won. <laughs> no, actually you both died, so you both lost. Yeah, but the monkey doesn't have a life count, so <laughs> in the end it wins. <laughs> No, it has a life count. It has a life Its life count is at zero. There you go. Dead. No! <laughs> well, at least it's well, a checkpoint. I suck so much at this game. 
This is the only Crash game I can legitimately say I suck at. <laughs> I don't even know what I just said after you. Herb that. <laughs> no! Okay, I get it. Do you attack him while he's rolling? Death. <laughs> they see me rolling. They hate him. You know, we've been going on for almost. You know, we've been going for almost 40 minutes. But, and the thing is, I'm just not used to that, and I kind of want to like have this all in one thing, so I can just like upload it all on the same day. I'll, I'll probably like divide it out into episodes, maybe if I. If I can find places to divide it up. But it's still all going to be uploaded on the same day if I do do that. So it will be uploaded on Thanksgiving. Of course, you already know that because you're watching it right now. <laughs> so I need to start talking and as if it were... Stop <laughs> talking differently. And yeah. Stop talking differently than myself. Stop talking differently, I said. You're oh, like, stop, stop talking differently than you. Of course, stop talking. <laughs> I just like how you got so wrong. Well, not so wrong, but your perceptions are completely always Did that Physics box? fail! <laughs> <laughs> it's like if you're gonna fall, at least fall to a tangible <laughs> at least like, like fall one, all the way down it's like one thing i saw in cheeseburger that's like physics i'm quite like why are you questioning how we got up there when you should be questioning why the boxes are floating in the first place <laughs> <laughs> oh I crap i didn't count okay at least if you hold x it gives you enough reaction time game. It's like I said a long time ago. There are five We're already a third into this game. Five, yeah. Five types of logic in this world that just doesn't plain out make sense to anybody. Video game logic, Hollywood logic, and physics? Okay. <laughs> there is there is... Uh, okay. I have forgotten the Hollywood logic. Anyways, there are five types of logic in this world that doesn't make sense to anybody... Um, except... Doesn't make sense to anybody, sometimes including the person who is thinking this logic. And now we get to see the original Ripperoo boss fight. Boss fight? Boss fight. I am suddenly from Russia. <laughs> He's in a straight jacket. I can see why. He's kind of insane. <laughs> right away, I died. Because <laughs> I jumped in the wrong place. Dang it! <laughs> the 3D graphics is kind of sketchy on this boss fight. No! Ripper Roop! Hurting him is kind of tricky because he just has to be in the right place at the right time. Get away! No! Stupid Rue! Stop it! <sighs> this is such a hard boss fight. He died and now he's drowning. Anyways, yeah. <sighs> As I was saying, there are five types of logic in this world that just doesn't make sense to anybody except the person who says it. And sometimes it just doesn't even make it doesn't even make sense. To the person who says it. One. Oh, I actually heard him, and then I died. <laughs> One is female one. Second. <laughs> We're gonna get so many haters. <laughs> <laughs> Second is parent logic. Third, teenager logic. 
Let's just be uh, let's just be honest, people. Oh us come the crap on! I heard of it, I die. Us teenagers sometimes we just don't make sense with our logic. It's true. Fourth it is. is video Come on, get hurt. Is die you stupid kangaroo of doom. Fourth is video game logic. Finally fifth. Well, oh, actually the fourth is Why is he only going between those spaces? Fourth is video game logic. Um along with Alright, let's not die this time. Let's not die. I said not die! <laughs> Why aren't you listening to me? <laughs> Before, as I was saying about the fourth one, um, that's video game logic slash other forms of entertainment like music sometimes. God damn it. Music has logic that just doesn't make sense. No! Uh, movies obviously has a lot of logic flaws. Alright, let's try detonating you, uh, now. Yes! No! Die, you wild kangaroo of doom! Now he's after you! Which actually works to my advantage. Come on! No! No! <laughs> Stop it! No! <laughs> you jumped into him! I had no choice! Uh, no! Come on! And he killed himself after I died! What? What? No! Not a single morsel of sense was made that day. Alright. One hit. From this way. I think he still has like a somewhat structured thing, because he seems to be only doing those like bottom six. <laughs> Big TNT. Come on! Yeah! Yeah, it's big TNT, yet it's no bigger an explosion than regular TNT, which works to my extreme disadvantage right now. Yeah, I think I see a pattern in way he's jumping. He's not going to this space, he's only going to like a set pattern of spaces. Um, this way, please! Yes! Ah! You didn't you. even lose any of Aku Aku. You vile monster, I have killed you! Not well, the monster. main cause of death in that boss fight is falling in the water, so... <laughs> the Lost City. Ah, uh, this is where the levels start getting really hard, isn't it? I just don't understand why... We I'm already had an incredibly difficult boss fight. Now it's time for the levels to get hard too, right? No, I really don't understand why, but I am feeling a very strange lack in um, commentary. Well, there's a lack in sensical commentary, let's put it that way. <laughs> I was like, I just can't think of anything that would be funny. I'm like out of funny right now. What happened to my random? I'm like that every day. And now I can't Everything die. <laughs> Everything Every die. Every other secretary that's ever been here for you, Alba. Everyone. No! <laughs> what? Didn't we discuss? <laughs> didn't we discuss this behind the? Yeah, we scenes? did. I would, if it's such a terrible job, I will take your firing. It just works to my advantage that way. 
Alright, seriously, if, it's a, if you if your boss is telling you that your job is terrible and that you have to do it, or else they'll fire you, just take the fire and I mean firing you from a terrible job isn't really nothing to throw. I'm going to take another reference from that movie and say, don't say. <laughs> <laughs> so what was the actual response in that movie to the... Silence. <laughs> because he was just so scary. <laughs> he was insane. <laughs> uh, okay. No! Okay. And again, if, I guess if you're, like, desperate for work, um, uh, you, if you're desperate for work, a lot of people would probably keep the job anyways, even if, um, it was a terrible job. Yeah, every single job on Dirty Jobs. Why else? <laughs> uh, I know how to get this life, but this thing is gonna kill me! <laughs> You die getting a ex getting an extra life. That the heck is this? Sense. The I, heck is it? That wasn't even there before. No. I just don't understand <coughs> that because what? Oh, I see. The thing was in here. Uh, found it. So why was that? Box still there. Don't question it. Just let it happen. <laughs> As I said, video game logic. It, it's in there with logics that just don't make sense to anybody else. All right, we can get this this time. Uh, yeah. It's a lot easier running on top of that than trying to run than past it. Precisely. Uh, no! Oh! Okay. They turned into one up root. I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> like I have no idea why they turned into one up root, but I will take it. You like instantaneously <laughs> kill them all. I missed an embryo token, but oh well. I don't even want to go to the embryo bonus area. Thank you much. Where did you, where did you miss it? I have no idea. Uh, this requires cracker jack timing. Okay. No. Get there, please. And by the way, those torches can kill you, so be careful. <laughs> Speaking of that witch, no. <laughs> Uh, 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 oh, what the heck? Okay. <laughs> that was a little sketchy. They're like, boxes back there. Okay. I'm just like, waiting. Oh, that's where the third one is. I'm just like, I don't want to go here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just like, waiting for like, some sort of weird trap back there that'll kill you. How am I supposed to pass that? <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> what are you asking me to do? <laughs> the impossible. That is what I'm what asking. That is exactly what I'm asking you to do. No. 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 You have to. Cause I'll fire you if you don't. No. <laughs> you can't fire me. I quit. <laughs> Good. Now, fine. Then turn over your station, and your computer, your controller, and your everything. What's in everything? All your video games and consoles. What are those? What you're playing. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> then do your job. Our commentary has stopped making sense. <laughs> 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 of 
course, then it stopped making sense like 15 minutes ago, so... Actually, I'm pretty sure... Well, no. Well, seeing as how there wasn't much of it... it OH GOD! <laughs> no! Seeing as how there wasn't much of it, it wasn't hard for there to be nonsensical. Okay. I'm like commentary out right now, I don't know why. I don't know, we can always take a break after this level, I guess. Huh. I don't know what it is, though. It's just like... I totally... I was like completely enthusiastic, and suddenly... I like lost all inkling of what I could say for commentaries. Like, May Breen, where'd you go? <laughs> <laughs> Oops. Oops. No! What? <laughs> no! Yay! Two, physics three, logic four. fail. Now the problem is, can you get in there? <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. No! Ah, I miscounted. <laughs> <laughs> I've screwed it up. <laughs> Good job, Sensei! What you did. Three. Five. Ah! <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, it's nine in this game. You're not, you're starting to count through it. Uh, that was close. I'm amazed I managed my way through that after that flip out. <laughs> That was a little close for comfort. So you can only <laughs> save at the bonus areas? Yeah, you can only save at the bonus areas. That is so stupid, it doesn't even make sense. I know, so basically if you want to save later in the game, you have to go back to the beginning of the game and do a bonus area that's easier. <laughs> <laughs> Come here, Mr. Iguana. You are Iguana Man, because I named you Iguana. Okay, jump in the middle. Boop. Why did they explode? I don't know. Oh, and let me guess, there's area beyond here in which there are more boxes making everything I've done so far pointless. Except I missed the... I died in the embryo bonus area anyway, so it doesn't matter. And he didn't <laughs> land right anyway, so... <laughs> So many things have to line into place. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. It's ridiculous. Temple ruins. Oh, I just realized what you have to do. Actually, you have to not die in the level at all. Oh, really? Yeah, I think I just remembered. That's what you have to do. It's not landing on it, right? It's you have to not die. That's stupid. Which is much easier said than done. Yet another reason why not to 100% this game. <laughs> Hear that, viewers? Don't even bother. Unless you're like an uber gamer who... Like, yeah, if you want to see 100% of LP of this game, go somewhere else. <laughs> I'm sure someone will happily cater to you. I don't know if anybody's helped you on 100% of this, but... Oh, I'm sure they have. I'm pretty sure you'll at least be able to find the details on, like, online. Like, yeah. Game facts or whatever. Uh, uh. It just okay. got... Okay. This only just got really quiet. I know. This level is so creepy. No, it's not that. We're just like out of things to say. This game is just like a It's like giving Die. us no reason to comment on it. Making me sad. Well, it's giving you no reason to comment, to make comments on anything. Me, I'm over here like 
Well, Parts you're the one me. who's playing, so yeah, it's I guess. easier for you to commentate. And he's just like, you didn't think of anything. Did I just almost killed myself. <laughs> you couldn't kill yourself on that? That's ridiculous! I think I may even be going the wrong way. Yeah. I honestly don't know for sure. There's boxes. No! That's usually an indicator that you're at least doing something right. Yeah. Yes. I mean, not necessarily going the right way, but you're doing something right. Okay, no! It's... No! It's just... No! It's just... It's just no. Just... No. I just realized how freaky those bats look. I'm gonna wait from the Or they could come right when I decide to move on. <laughs> of course. That's how they play. No. <laughs> yeah. Uh, when I said female logic doesn't make sense. Dang it. To others. I have had plenty of girls tell me that they don't even Whoa. understand some of the half of the things that they do and why they do them. They just know they do it. Then when there's a problem here that can potentially be fixed, but it won't be fixed. <laughs> <laughs> it's like we're Okay, I think the one for fruit is directing me to go this way, yes. It's like, uh, words, and it's kind of like, um, how there are some words where it's like, you know what it means, but you don't know how to describe it. You know what I mean? Kind of like, the, kind of like derp. I, I'd like, know what it, what a derp is, and what it means, but I just like, I will not be able to tell you, not be able to give you a, very it's basically a context good. clue word. <laughs> I'm not be able to give you a very good uh, description. It's just one of those words. Here's my description of the word dirt. Perp a dirt. <laughs> <laughs> Enough said. And then your description of that derp. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so glad to be out of that level. That's actually one of the more difficult levels. Of course, we haven't even gotten to the... No! Speaking of the devil! <laughs> oh, no. to nowhere! Nobody likes this level or its counterpart. I can't say that I do or don't like it because I haven't done it. Or it. It's anything. awful. <laughs> I'm gonna this is easily the second hardest level in the game, and the hardest level in the game is this level's counterpart. <laughs> I want to call. I don't know why, but I really feel like calling it the road to now here. I know, right? <laughs> no, it's not like because of the structure of the level or anything. It's just. No, but I know, it's just, I thought that too. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, I know it set reads nowhere, but now here just also pops into mind. I think it's like the handwriting of the thing. Oh, you can't kill the boar? Okay. So yeah, those boars that you see with the, the purple ones, they fall out from under you. And those red ones, I don't even know why they put those there, because if you step on those, they just fall out from right under your feet, and you have no chance of survival. <laughs> and watch, it gets terrible. See these little tiny spaces I have to land on? <laughs> land on, run on, and try to get And of course, the hog is able to run through air! <laughs> did I just see a light, like, all the way up here? I did! <laughs> <laughs> uh, 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 
Okay. Well, at least they're being nice. It's pretty much going to be the whole level is me making noises of <laughs> despair. No! <laughs> okay, you can stop. <laughs> I just wanted to see how long I could do that. Uh, I don't know what it is, but I seem to have a massive reserve of at least present to me. <laughs> no! Down on the spikes below that I just noticed. Uh, uh, okay. This level is so nerve wracking. <laughs> no! <laughs> you know, I don't know what it is, but actually, that noise I made kind of helped. I guess it was kind of the fact uh, that I built some magma in the background. I don't know. I, basically, I made it less. No! <laughs> Did you just actually land on it? I mean, it's like. No, I landed on the ice, and then the ice pushed me back into it while I was waiting for the boar. No, it was funny, because you actually were, like, standing on mid-air for a bit because of that one broken boar. <laughs> so if I jumped, I could have potentially survived. Exactly. Dang it! <laughs> Which really doesn't make sense, because you to totally should have just, like, fallen right through the boar. <laughs> I hate this <laughs> Jump, 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 jump. <clears throat> Damn it! <sighs> There's just so much room for error, and you just can't stop. If you stop, you die. <laughs> you stop, you die. Unless you're, unless you get to one of those wooden boards, I guess. Dang it! Why did they even put those there? <laughs> What is the point of having those red things other than just to annoy the player? <laughs> I declare with the fact that, oh, you can land there, but you can't land there. This <laughs> I know. It's the stupidest thing! Alright, let's try not to die this time. <laughs> of course, if you can instantaneously. Something I've noticed is for those board, those half boards thing, whatever, um, you. If you were to, like, instantaneously jump right after landing on it, and this would have to be simultaneous, so you would need extreme super crackerjack timing. Um, it would be potentially possible to land on and jump off from those, but because that, oh, that, there's no point in actually even trying that. God, just don't. Damn, dang it! <laughs> Stupid boar! I hate the boar. No! <laughs> the boar's revenge is riding on it. It's getting its buddies to kill you on this bridge. <laughs> <laughs> I can't concentrate anymore. You want somebody else to take over just to give you a break for a second? No, we're gonna do this. <laughs> Somehow. <laughs> no! Okay. Wait for good time. <laughs> that was the sound of me head desking. <laughs> okay. If we could just pass that stupid boar, things would be good. Then you see two boar. All right. Now if I can avoid. Uh, just outrun it! Out! Uh, yes! Victory for the Empire! Uh, if you declare yourself as the Empire, you do realize Whoa! that you're going to lose by falling down Whoa. the electrical shaft. Why did you just kill yourself? <laughs> <laughs>
I thought I could jump on top of <laughs> Don't take <laughs> unnecessary chances. <laughs> I think you need some like time off after like this episode. At least to like get a drink of water or something. I think I might be broken. <laughs> the level broke sensei. God dang it, I killed a turtle and now I can't make the jump. Just do it. <laughs> The turtle that can also jump on, well, fly on air. It's just over there, Sensei. If you die one more time, Hank. Ah, uh, that was a doozy. <laughs> oh. I literally have a headache. <laughs> I think we need like a water break or something. Yeah, we do. Anyway, this has been Sensei Mewtwo 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Oh, man, 76. And temporarily ending this gaming lesson. You'll obviously see more today. See ya.